Indian National Trade Union Congress is the trade union wing of the Indian National Congress. It was founded 3 May 1947 and is affiliated with the International Trade Union Confederation. According to provisional statistics from the Ministry of Labour, INTUC had a membership of 3,892,011 in 2002. INTUC is widely accepted as a trade union that works with the management and is not a typical confrontational organization. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Birth and Growth of INTUC. The foundation of INTUC on the 3rd of May 1947, just 3 months before India attained independence. Acharya J. B. Kripalani, who was then president of the Indian National Congress inaugurated the founding conference of INTUC. Among the distinguished leaders who attended the opening session were Pandit Jawaharlal Nehru, Shankarao Deo, Jagjivan Ram, B. G. Kare, Op Medhab, Aruna Asaf Ali, Ram Manohar Lohia, Ashoka Mehta, Ramchandra Sakaram Ruakar, Manaben Patel, and other prominent trade unionists. Under the guidance of Mahatma Gandhi, the founding fathers, in their wisdom, preferred to let the INTUC have an independent identity with its own constitution, while at the same time functioning as an arm of the Congress. Topic INTUC Congress relationship Since inception, INTUC has been maintaining very close relationship with AICC. On several occasions there have been discussions over the relationship between INTUC and AICC and the need for having continuous dialogue between the two organizations on issues of mutual interests. In order to have regular interaction between the INTUC and AICC a five-member committee was appointed by the AICC in 1967 and Gulzarilal Nanda was the convener. Similarly during 2002, an advisory committee was formed under the chairmanship of Pranab Mukherjee. Three general secretaries represented AICC in the committee. On behalf of INTUC, Rajendra P. D. Singh General Secretary and two vice presidents were represented. Dr. G. Sanjeeva Reddy was included as special invitee in the CWC. Objectives of INTUC To establish an order of society which is free from hindrance in the way on an all-round development of its individual members, which fosters the growth of human personality in all its aspects and goes to the utmost limit in progressively eliminating social political or economic exploitation and inequality, the profit motive in the economic activity and organization of society and the anti-social concentration in any form to place industry under national ownership and control in suitable form in order to realize the aforesaid objectives in the quickest time. To organize society in such a manner as to ensure full employment and the best utilization of its manpower and other resources. To secure increasing association of the worker in the administration of industry and their full participation in its control. To promote generally the social civic and political interest of the working class, to secure an effective and complete organization of all categories of workers, including agricultural labor. To guide and co-ordinate the activities of the affiliated organizations. To assist and co-ordinate the activities of the affiliated organizations. To assist in the formation of trade unions. To promote the organization of workers of each industry on a nationwide basis. To assist in the formation of regional or Pradesh branches or federations. To secure speedy improvement of conditions of work and life and of the status of the workers in industry and society. To obtain for the workers various measures of social security, including adequate provision in respect of accidents, maternity, sickness, old age and unemployment. To secure a living wage for every worker in normal employment and to bring about a progressive improvement in the workers' standard of living. To regulate hours and other conditions of work in keeping with the conditions of the workers and to ensure the proper enforcement of legislation for the protection and uplift of labor. To establish just industrial relations. To secure redressal of grievances, without stoppages of work, by means of negotiations and conciliation and failing these by arbitration or adjudication. 
to take recourse to other legitimate method, including strikes or any suitable form of satyagraha, where adjudication is not applied and settlement of disputes within a reasonable time by arbitration is not available for the redress of grievances. To make necessary arrangements for the efficient conduct satisfactory and speedy conclusion of authorized strikes or satyagraha. To foster the spirit of solidarity, service, brotherhood cooperation and mutual help among the workers. To develop in the workers a sense of responsibility towards the industry and community. To raise the workers' standard of efficiency and discipline. Mahatma Taylor's Kong RSS MHADMA Taylor's Congress All India National Life Insurance EMP. Federation Central GOVT Employees Confederation Federation of National Postal Organizations Indian National Bank Employees Federations Indian National Bank Officers Congress Indian National Building Construction, Forest and Woodworkers Federation Indian National Cement Workers Federation Indian National Chemical Workers Federation Indian National Defence Workers Federation Indian National Electricity Workers Federation Indian National Food and Drink Workers Federation Indian National Jute Workers Federation Indian National Metal Workers Federation Indian National Mine Workers Federation Indian National Municipal and Local Bodies Workers Federation Indian National Paper Mill Workers Federation Indian National Plantation Workers Federation Indian National Port and Dock Workers Federation Indian National Rural Labor Federation Indian National Salaried Employees and Professional Workers Federation Indian National Sugar Mill Workers Federation Indian National Textile Workers Federation Indian National Transport Workers Federation National Federation of Indian Railwaymen National Federation of Petroleum Workers National Federation of Telecommunication Organizations MCF Workers Union Nangal Bakra Mazdor Sang Times Minus Vizaka Steel Employees Congress Bikara Steel Workers Union BSWU Rastriya Kalyuri Majdor Sang RCMS All India Vyapari Vyavasai Congress National Labour Congress Committee NLC C West Bengal Splitted to INTUC DESIYASAKSHARATHAPRAVARTHAKA Union DSPU Topic Presidents Topic See also Trade Unions in India Indian National Congress <laughs>